Hello, hello, hello. We are live with today's Animal Crossing stream. So I'm just gonna share that on all the social medias and then we'll hop into the game. It is Wednesday and uh, yeah, so starting with some Animal Crossing. Gracie is in town today, so fingers crossed we get something new from her. Then later we'll be playing some uh, some Star Wars Nice Little Republic, which I just realized I didn't include in my um, going live message on Discord and uh, Twitter. But that's fine. Let's just uh, hop right into some Animal Crossing and see how things go. November 10th, 3.26 p.m. Trantor. That's all accurate. Start with Slicer just to do our opening thing. And thank you for that host, Astro. Much appreciated as always. Y'all should go check out the Astro Path if you haven't already. Awesome streamer. Last playing Ape Escape 3. I think he was getting close to the end of that one. I wasn't able to catch a stream, but I think I saw something about that some on Twitter or something. Okay, let's see what we got here now. Uh, first of all, any new villagers? Shouldn't be. Based on yeah the patterns we've recognized. Tom Nook, studying modern sofa. Hmm. But then we should have a letter in the post office for a slicer from Twerp. Let's just confirm that. That'll be that letter right there. Awesome. Awesome possum. Okay, that's all we need to do a slicer right now. Let's switch over to Rick. And do our regular daily stuff. And I guess later... I, we'll probably do when we switch back to slicer later. Is when we'll also go and grab... Um, Wash Gracie's car with Slicer. Because we need to do that with three of my characters. We'll obviously do them once with Rick. Uh, actually, I might be playing as all three of my characters today. Because I only have stuff to put in my gyroid with Rick for all three characters. Uh, yes. Rick. Also, I apologize for the uh, late start today. Almost half an hour late to start stream today. You know, just tired from work and all that. Okay. Yeah, do we have anyone new now? Jay, Freckles, Caesar, Puddles, Eleanor, Billy, Twerp, Opal, Olive, Rhoda, Maple. Harry, Alfonso, Gabby, Mint. Mint is new. Mint is completely new. And I don't even... I'm not even sure who Mint is off the top of my head. Yeah, Mint is completely new. Maybe I'll recognize them when I see them. But yeah, it's that on the hard sofa. Tale of a T-Rex. That's something. Skull of an Apatosaurus. And finally, a dino egg. With which we're going to make a dino omelette. That should be a bit more work, I think. Right? Nah. I'm never happy with camera <laughs> angle. Okay. Yeah, what do we have here in the basement to empty out? Uh, yeah. 
One, two, three, four. And then we still have those three gyroids, but that we'll worry about tomorrow, probably. Okay. Store. So the carpet is going to Jake. Because we already got one for uh, Samantha, like for to put on the floor on her main floor. Now that just for the um for the um for the complete collection of carpets in Jake's house. Jack in the box and the spooky wardrobe go to Samantha. Finish off her main floor. And the fishing trophy is gonna go into Slicer's basement. Awesome. Awesome possum. Anything on the message board? Just have to think for a second. Uh Season of Plenty is upon us. Join us to celebrate our bounty at the annual Harvest Festival on the fourth Thursday in November. I will be there. That's, I guess, not next two weeks from now. I guess two weeks from tomorrow. But yeah, that should be good. Uh, that we've already found. Uh, Harvest Festival is the next. Uh, that's the next big one. Like where we'll be taking, uh, getting a. Another carpet, another wallpaper, and at least 11 pieces of furniture, I think. I think it'll be 11, because I'm pretty sure it's 10, let's actually just look, but I'm pretty sure, like, what, 10 from, um, from, like, the Harvest series, but then also the Cornucopia. We have from Tortimer. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, so ten from Franklin for the Harvest series, plus the Cornucopia, which we get from uh, Tortimer. So that's not too shabby. Eleven piece of furniture, a wallpaper, and carpet. That'll be. Two weeks. That's something to look forward to, because that's yeah, it could be another big like big step forward in our uh, in our goal for 100% that, and then Christmas Eve next month to get like the jingle series. And before you know it. You know, once we get through those two things, then it'll just be like a lot of just... Those will be the last two big things where we're giving up a bunch of stuff. After that, it's gonna be like, you know, just like filling in the holes and such. And of course, continuing to work on like our NES games. Opal is not in right now, so I've gotta keep an eye out for Opal. Carrie is right here, though. A little, oh, there's Opal as well. Uh, never me. Oh, thinking of moving? Okay, okay. Uh, yes. Okay. I was trying to be nice. You can still move if you want to. Opal? I'm doing well. Eating properly. Uh, no comment. No comment. Uh, talk to me. Ooh, gorgeous prize. What event is held each year in mid-March? Cherry Festival? No, that's April. Wow. You don't have to be so rude about it. It's 
And I guess what were, what were the other options? I now I'm blanking on what even the options were. But I got it wrong. So that's fine. I'm not perfect. Even I can be wrong once in a while. Hundred bells. Hundred bells from Well there's Gracie. Found her already. So So uh what we're gonna do is of course be washing her car. And uh yeah. And fingers crossed we can uh, get something new from her. So, uh, let me just quickly grab this money and then we'll go wash her car. So, for anyone unaware, with Gracie's car, it's a mini game where you just press the A button as quickly as possible. Now, just by tapping it normally, I can't. I can't do it. I cannot be successful. So what I do is I roll a, roll a pen over it, and uh, you know that works. So that's what we're gonna do. So let's see here. Where's my pen that I use? Uh, this one. Yes, this one. So I will be uh, turning off the mic while I do it because otherwise it's going to be just very noisy yeah so and then and it's RNG so we do a good job if we do so so job she'll give us standard clothing which we don't want if we do a bad job she just gets pissed if we do a good job she'll give us one of her exclusive pieces of clothing but it could be something she's already given us before so everyone cross your fingers, cross your toes, cross your hearts, and cross your souls. Okay, I'm going to turn off the mic now. Well, we did a good job, so that's the first step. Now the rest is down to RNG. So let me open up my clothing list. And, as soon as I find it. and come on, something new. Butterfly shirt. Caterpillar tea, that's still new. That's new. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's go see if something should say anything with me putting it on. Okay, we already got. Ooh. Hey, all of. Uh. Also, notice the fossil there. What's up? Yeah. Of course I've heard of her. I literally got this outfit from her. I literally just got this outfit from her. <laughs> right ladder. To the museum. Oh, I can guess I can close the, uh... Go back to that percentage... list. And so that was all that we talked to, but Rhoda also lives in this acre, but is not in right now. So we gotta keep an eye out for Rhoda. Here is Maple. 3 p.m., yes. 
all, all the unhealthy things I do, and she keeps commenting on the thing that I'm not actually doing. I do, I got up plenty early this morning to go to work. Then I was out of work, and I worked, and now I'm here. And doing my thing. Okay, let's switch back to this and put the caterpillar tea in my basement. Add that to the collection. The growing collection. Clothing. Eventually we're gonna have to empty some more of this stuff out of the basement, but for now, it still works. I mean, are we even? It might not actually, it might not even be really an issue. Guess we'll see how it goes. Okay. Anything around Nooks? Doesn't look like it. Okay, let's see what's inside Nooks today. Uh, firstly... 88. Okay, so we're not selling turnips here today. Good to know. We are selling... Fossils, though. 11,400. Good call, good call. Anything over here? Ooh, red paint, red paint, red paint. Yes, yes, yes. You've sold me. You, you, you already got, got me sold on uh, this. Not just... Let's do the thing. Excellent. And what do we got upstairs? Probably nothing I need. I mean, I know it's nothing I need. Yeah. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay. Oh, well, here is Rhoda, who we still needed to talk to. Something really weird after been raining. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. You dig up a gyroid? Is that what it was? Did you dig up a gyroid? Weed. Grab the chunk from the dump before she does ranch paper and danger shirt. Danger with Robinson. Anything else going on over here? Don't look like it. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. And it's only found one fossil, right? Right. As we are finishing off first quadrant, only one fossil found so far. But you know, found the. We did also find the uh, money rock, although not yet the glowing spot. So we've gotta keep on keeping on. Got quite a few weeds already. Hey, Gabby. I see the glowing spot there. Uh, just hang. Sure. Okay, yeah, I'll definitely take a free peach. Yeah, I mean, the only thing that goes bad in this game is um, turnips. Fruit, fruit is fine no matter how long. It's uh, sitting around for, which is probably one of the most unrealistic aspects of this game. But I have I have matter in oranges. I just remembered. 
gonna start using those. Uh, any goings on? Oh yeah, Doi. Gracie. <laughs> we, we already washed our car and got an outfit for our troubles. Anything lost? Okay. Nothing lost. I've still only found the one fossil. I'm starting to get a mite bit worried that I've missed something. And here is Mint, our newest villager. My name is Rick, yes, that's correct. That is my name. Don't wear it out. Or do you wear it? How do you wear out a name? It's a good question. Do not know the answer to that one, though. Alfonso. Oh, uh, I have a peach. You could eat the peach I have. Talk to me. Shop at Nooks for all your needs from Tonkin. Uh, definitely orange. I meant he has an orange lightsaber, but that works too. Okay. For, for, for context, so Jonathan is one of the characters in my other town. Um, but all the characters, all my characters in both this town and the other town, or whatever, are named for characters from, uh, Characters that I first created with as Leo characters, and Jonathan I had as a little Jedi with the orange lightsaber. So anytime, and that's so this is not the first time Alfonso, specifically even Alfonso has asked me what I think about a letter from Jonathan. I said orange because that's always exactly where my mind goes. Okay. Still only found the one fossil. Well, I saw the one fossil across before we crossed the river. I saw it on this side. So when we get up to that point, we'll get the second fossil. Or possibly like third if we get another one first. Possibly fourth or fifth, even if we somehow get all the rest first. But that seems unlikely at this point. But you never know. You never know. Freckles! You've been studying Japanese for a while, haven't you? That's like, mentioned that a couple times. I do know the gyro in front of my house. Uh, I know already. I do think I'm so smart. Yeah, yeah. Try setting the price a little higher. Uh huh. It's a, it's a clever tactic, Freckles. A very clever tactic. Also a bit of a mean tactic. You really want to be, you know, scamming your friends out of their money? No, you want to be scamming your enemies out of their money. Maybe your family members as well. Not your friends. <laughs> you, 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 you okay there, Pels? Well, why are you trying to run it up the river? Just, just curious here. Uh, what's new? Sure. Second person to give me a... Give me a peach for free. After picking a fruit tree close. 78. She has more left. The other one was Gabby, who only has 20-some left, I think she said. No, I'm just trying to... That's our second fossil only. Or we only found one on the other side of the, on the east side of the river, which is like it's entirely possible that like you know only one showed up there. The rest are on this side, but at the same time, we're going so far in that I'm yeah we're we're we're, we're we've explored three of the four quadrants and only found two of the five fossils. 
Unless you find the other three in this remaining quadrant. Thinking I'm, we might be back to me missing some fossils. And Billy. It's Billy the Kid. Okay. Care to chat? Hey, Jay. Jay Garrick. What's new? Yes. Oh, yes, I can, I know. But the game doesn't give you a depends on the insect option, so that means you have to choose one or the other, and either way they'll be like, that's fine if this, but what if that? Weed. Twerp around here somewhere. Oh, weed. And there's our third fossil. Fossil number three. Just for me. Okay. Twerp is around. It just. Hiding inside, probably. Yes. Nope, not selling any snake oil today. Let's talk. Uh, Got from Slicer. Welcome to Trantoria. Good for you. Good for you. Here's another fossil, fossil number four. Just one more. So at least we found four of them. Will we get the five? Stay tuned to find out. Move up our lacy paper and our aloha paper. A fossil in the letter. And add the ranch paper to our side stack. Freckles we already talked to, and Caesar hiding inside, hiding inside. Yes, just me. Just come by to chat. Let's talk. Uh, this is true. This is true. we already talked to but Elmer. Okay. So we've explored the town and we missed one fossil. We are back to having one fossil missing. See, so that's yeah. Yeah, there is still one fossil out there that we didn't find, but that's fine. Oh, four of them, and we'll just have to, you know, keep our eyes out a bit more next time uh, tomorrow. Or I mean, if we happen to run across come across it today and see it, great. But like tomorrow's the next time we'll be doing a full like town exploration. Okay. 
Doesn't mean we won't have to come back in after this, because if we had one more letter, we still have to leave and come back in, because it's full at the moment. Like, you know, it's leave and, like, immediately go back in, but it's not like it's massive time sink or anything, but it is, you know, something. Okay, uh, let's quickly switch to Slicer. And, uh... Yeah. Let's actually do a couple things with Slicer here. Firstly, uh, hold our villager list, because that's the first thing we'll do. Firstly, I update this. Twerp. Okay. Take Twerp off the list. Another villager that has lived here. And we've got a letter from to prove it. Then, um, is that Elf? Yeah. Stay there. So then, um, should be 176. We are on 175 on villager total, so that makes sense. And we are now at 176. And then let me bring up my calculator. 176 divided by 218 equals 81%. That's nice. Up another percentage point. Awesome. Okay, so that's done and dealt with. Excuse me. I'm not sure why I went in here. I know what I intended to do. Um, let's bring up while we're playing a slicer, might as well. Check items. Fishing trophy, because we're using slicer to store stuff, because yeah. Main floor is complete. Upstairs we need the igloo stuff, which we will later. And then basement. We need a bunch of these gifts. So we'll put this fishing trophy next to the angler trophy. Um. Have a little more things. Then, finally, before we switch back. Oh no, not finally. Technically, we have two more things to do. One of them is, um, where was Gracie? D4, right? I believe it was D4. Let us see if we can't get another one of these outfits, like butterfly shirt, fiendish shirt, grass shirt, lavender robe, orange pinstripe, or swell shirt. So once again, a strategy, because it's a game, mini game where you rapidly press the A button, the strategy is to rub a pen over the A button really quickly. So yeah, I'm going to turn off my mic while we do that. So. 
Yeah, turn off the mic now and wish me luck. Well, we did a good job. Now it's just a matter of what we get. And the survey says... Oh, that's working. Grape shirt. Damn it. Um, so we already have that one. Let's just confirm we do actually have it in Rick's base. Because obviously we, we have got it. But that doesn't mean we, like, remember to... Because I think there might have been something that we, or especially early on, that we accidentally sold or something before I was like, oh no, I need to be making sure to keep one of each. Oh yeah, right there. Right at the back of this one. Okay. Shame, but it is what it is. Um, let's go sell them then. And let's go meet our newest villager so we can send them a welcome letter. And then I'll switch back to Rick. So, we also go back to the percentage. We do still have one more chance to get something from Gracie today. So, there is still a chance we could get one more new one. But again, it could be another duplicate, so we'll just have to... Wait and see. Uh. Well, that's annoying. Mint is not in right now. That <laughs> we actually have to track her down. I'll check by the wishing well. Oof, we're gonna have to do a full sweep of the town then, I think. So we'll go back to the starting acre just because that makes it easier to be th thorough. good starting position. Okay, so we are actually going to be doing another sweep of the town just until we find Mint. Uh, who could be, you know, anywhere. Anywhere and everywhere. Haven't had this issue yet with, uh, you know. But the fact that it was possible to happen means it was only a matter of time until it did happen. And that's where we're at now. So, it's fine. It is what it is. It does mean we can also be like, you know, doing another sweep for uh, where that missing fossil is. Although, to be fair, I'm probably less I'm kind of rushing now, so... Oh, here's Mint. Which is weird, because this is the acre we were already in. Go 
and send that letter. And then tomorrow we shall get a response. Okay. the next letter. Excellent. And then I think, yeah, now we're done with Slicer and can switch back to Rick. for today. We're we'll playing as Samantha and or Jake as well. I mean, definitely Samantha. Um, probably Jake, because we do have stuff in the gyro for both of them, but... Yeah, no, we will. Oh. And again, we'll see. Might hold off on grabbing the other thing with Jake until tomorrow, but well, that's for future I have to worry about. Like, I mean, later in the stream for me to decide. So we still have more things to do as Rick, and then Samantha, and then we'll see where we're at time-wise. And also, I guess if. We get a price spike on turnips over in Pretorius. Danger. Oh, wait. Let us update this with twerp. One second here. Um, game audio felt a little off. One, two, three, four, seven. That's nine. That's sixteen. That makes sense. Yeah, let's sell the junk before we head over to Protorus. Excuse me. Uh, 1085. Awesome. Now to Protorus to see what things are like over there today. Taking a trip. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Well, thank you for your patience. Staying here all day, helping custom, helping uh, travelers with uh, with preparations for traveling by train and all that jazz. Valuable service you provide, Porter. So keep up the good work. Okay. trip is comfortable and uh, the other thing that was said, whatever it was. Okay.
Okay. What's that everyone else been up to today? Anyone doing anything interesting? Anything fun? board. Oh uh, yeah, that's the same thing we saw back in Trantor. Uh, we got a big star shirt and some woodland paper, uh, which we don't need at the moment. Three full stacks of stationery at the moment, so that I'm good on for now. Firstly, 119, good price, but not a price spike, so. Uh, not something we're selling for yet. Yeah, if, if, if we get to um, Saturday and don't have, don't get a price spike, I may be like, oh, I should have sold on... today on Wednesday but that said getting to Saturday and selling even at a loss would not be as big of a regret as you know selling today and then getting a price spike so it's still worth it to wait even if that is a tempting amount okay Plus that means we all have time for some Star Wars and I still don't public yet later. Whereas Yeah, if we were selling turnips, obviously we wouldn't. We'd be just Animal Crossing. Sahara on Friday? November twelfth, yep. That's Friday. Today is the tenth and Wednesday. Anything lost? They have something lost. But what might it be? Oh, yes, we'll see. What might it be? Kitty shirt, okay. Good stuff, good stuff. No, thank you. Just check if Gulliver happens to have washed ashore this fine Wednesday afternoon. Or maybe Wednesday morning. He might have washed ashore this morning. We just would only be finding him now, but doesn't look like he's washed ashore at all today unless... Nope, not over there. Yeah, that's the thing. When you find Gulliver washed ashore, it's like, how long has he been lying there for? You don't know. Really, like, any time since you last went along the beach, he could have been lying there since just, like, shortly after that. And all of the other villagers who walked by him refused to help. Sell that shirt. I mean, I could just sell it just when I get back, but but I don't know. There, there's no real reason that it matters. It's not like there's like fees I have to pay for bringing it over the border or anything. <laughs> border between towns. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. It's, it's my habit, and you know, I'm very much a creature of habit. Back to Trantor. I 
forgetting something. Is it game related? Or is it something else related? I don't know. If it's important, I'll probably get screwed over by forgetting it, but then I'll know. <laughs> Knowing is half the battle. The other half is, you know, uh. And, uh, what was I gonna say? Um. Are you freaking kidding me? We're at 15 people and nobody moved? <laughs> nobody moved. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. We have a full village. I traveled. And nobody moved. What are the chances of that? What even are the chances? You know, earlier when, uh, when, uh, Carrie asked how I feel about her moving, I shouldn't, you know, I should have answered that I'd be okay with it. Because I, I feel like that may have had impact. But it is what it is. Gotta accept it and move on. Okay, so see my catalog. So furniture should still be 541. Well, that should be going up tomorrow, because tomorrow is some event. Officer's Day, I think, so that'll be uh, getting, like, the police station or lost and found or whatever it is model. Excuse me. Okay, wallpaper should be 65 still, as should carpet. Yeah, clothing though should have gone up to 238. Indeed it did. Two thirty eight. Calculator. Two thirty eight divided by two forty seven. 96, so we're still at 96%. Okay. But yeah, which means just nine outfits left. We're, we're, we're getting close to the end of that. Okay, items should still be 56. Stationary, 62. Gyroids, 127. Fossils, 25. Music, 27. Realizing. This also means we might not get a new villager moving in tomorrow. We still might, um, if, I guess, if after I travel to Praetorius tomorrow, somebody moves there, then we'll get, you know, a new villager. Well, as soon as we get back, the space will open up. But, 
Uh, what am I doing now? Depositing some money, some cash money. See how I do with that today. Where is Okay, let's go. Phase one, nice and easy. No difficulty there. Phase two. Aha. Good stuff. And phase three. round. Okay. So far off to a good start. I got the greatest patterns here, but it's going slow enough that it doesn't really matter. Excellent. Phase six. Yeah, for anyone coming in now, wondering what's going on, like, this is an Animal Crossing. It's, it's an NES game with an Animal Crossing. Part of my goal for 100%ing the GameCube Animal Crossing. I also want it 100% all 19 of the NES games within it. So far, I have 100%ed none of them. Constantly working on th them. Primarily working on this one, Balloon Fight. Mainly because of the fact that it's the first one alphabetically. Honestly, that's the, that's honestly the main thing. <laughs> main design factor of why this is my main focus. So also when I finish this one, my main focus will be baseball, which is the next one alphabetically, which I still do occasionally as well. Played, other than the Forbidden Four, which I don't have yet, I've played each, at least a little bit of each of the NES games in here. I mean, the Forbidden Four I have, are all NES games I have played outside of Animal Crossing. But, yeah, I don't have any of them with, here within Animal Crossing as of yet. That was almost bad. I need to be careful. I only have the one balloon. Where is the lightning going? Okay. Let's... Okay. 
Okay. Phase nine. Gotcha. Okay, now I got our balloon back. Bonus round. Every every third, after every third phase is a bonus round. And if we're down to just one balloon, we'll get the second one back. Which is nice. Round coming at ya. Fresh off the presses. Gotcha. Nice. Good stuff. the 200,000 mark as we enter into phase 13. too close to that lightning. I should not have been playing that risky. It's completely unnecessary. It didn't kill me there, but it very well could have. Okay, phase 14. Fifteen. That's going a 
bit smoother there. Excellent. Another bonus round. Is that going to be enough to put us over 300,000 or just short of it, I think? Yeah, just short of it. Like, the first thing we do is going to put us over. Mm. And of course, we lost our one of our balloons right away. That's not great, but it is what it is. I'm also surprised I did not die at all there. Okay. I mean, th th yeah, that's a level layout that often causes us to lose a balloon or even a life, so it's not too surprising. The fact that it's right after or bonus round. It's just annoying. Where's the lightning going? Bit of an easier layout, but it could still screw us over regardless. Exactly where I prefer to be. Two balloons. Oof. Although we missed two balloons here on this, so we're not getting a perfect. Only two balloons? Yeah, only two. Eighteen. Okay. Not ideal, but it is what it is. Thank you. 
And you. Excellent. Another bonus round. Let's see if we can redeem ourselves. We're missing two on the last one. Let's get back to perfect if we can. Yes. Awesome. That puts over 400,000. We're moving and grooving, folks. Moving, grooving. All that stuff. Phase 22. Nineteen only. Missed the last one. Oh, that's too bad, because that would have put us... Yeah, that would have put us over for 500,000. But that's just the way it goes sometimes. did not die or lose a balloon. <laughs> the whole point is kind of astonishing. Phase 26. Round. Let's try to do a bit better on this one. And if we do any better, that means, you know, getting a perfect because we only missed one on the last one. Okay. Yeah, that's it. 
No, they're perfect. Okay. There we go. He's 29. Let's try it again, but I have two balloons. Perfect. Help us over 600,000 points. We are moving, we are grooving. We're just about 600,000 even before we got the super bonus. So that's awesome. Thank you. 
too much stuff going on. Okay, so there's our death. But we got pretty far without dying. So... Obviously, we can still keep going, but this isn't the, you know, what I consider my 100% run of this mode, because it needs to be deathless. But, what were we up to? We're up to 33. Nice, another perfect. So if we're up to 33, that's like one third of the, we made it through, one third, yeah. So we're passing around a thousand points. Okay, three, four, yeah, so we made it about a third of the way before dying. That's honestly pretty dang impressive. I don't know if that's the furthest I've made it without dying, or if I've made it further without dying before, but either way, it's not something I do very often, even if I have done it before, which I'm not, I'm not sure. I should almost be keeping track of like the furthest I made it without dying instead of just the furthest I've made it, period. Oof, that was annoying. I was kind of caught between two of them. There's only so much I could do there. Can I get up here? There we go. Oof, 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 oof. Okay, we might not be making it much further. Is what it is. 37. you. 38. Thank you. 
survive until he gets in the water. Or gets eaten by the fish. Okay. 39. Need to drop down a bit. Gotcha. Another bonus round. I think I missed one there. Find soon enough. Yeah, I did miss one. That's a shame. But it is what it is. Phase 43. Never mind. Lightning anyway, so that ends that. Did decently though. And yeah, I think I am going to mark down. Um furthest for this 
phase without dying. 33. And like I said, I might have made it further than that before, but... Actually, no. Further say is before dying, I should say, because 33 is where I died. Which, you know, yeah. uh, then I think we're done with Rick. Let's switch over to Samantha. Close the balloon fight. Uh, first we'll open... First we'll do the clothing. There is my clothing list. Okay, apparently we're playing as Jake. That <laughs> uh, works just as fine. Let's go wash Gracie's car one last time for this visit, and fingers crossed we get one of those outfits I still need from her. Go to Gracie. So, as per usual, it's for anyone unaware, it's a mini game where you press A button really quickly to wash your car. I use a trick where I rub a pen over the A button to get, you know, to actually be able to succeed at it, whereas if I just tapped it with my finger, I would not be getting it. I'll, I turn off the mic while I'm doing it, so I'm going to turn off the mic right now so it's not like, you know, too noisy while I'm doing it. I guess my hand was tired from the other two, because it's just a so-so job. So we're just going to get standard clothing. That's unfortunate. What did she give us, though? Seven ball shirt. Yeah. But, since, yeah, now that, that was three times, she is now gone. So we can go and find out who the next visitor is going to be. So we only got one new outfit from her today. Which, not ideal, but, you know, it's better than nothing. Like, it's still progress. Even if more progress would have been nicer. Now that she's gone, yeah, we can go check who's going to be coming next. Ah, Katrina. Katrina doesn't help me out too much. Uh, November 12th. That's Friday, because today is Wednesday on the 10th. Okay, well. At least it's soon, so then, you know. I mean, we won't see her until sad. Honestly, we're... Might even completely miss her, because she shows up at... 
9 p.m. and come, stays till the following day at 9 p.m. So we'll probably see her because the plan is Saturday to start a stream at 8 p.m. In which case we will see her. But if we're late to start, uh, what am I going to open now? Then yeah, then we'll see how it goes. Carpet. Excellent. So we're gonna go. Oh. How dare you? Just the one cockroach, though. That's not too shabby. So a spooky carpet should go right here. As we fill up our fill up our basement. Um Yeah. Still have more holes, but I mean we'll fill in like next time we get Sahara, which actually Right, Sahara coming to Praetorus on Friday, we can get like another few, depending on exactly how we do it. Uh, one, two, three, four. So four of the ones in here we need from Sahara. Snowman carpet, jingle carpet. Okay, block, block floor we could really grab right now if we wanted to, but... That's just, you know, with, uh, be a code, but we'll worry about that another time. Okay. And with that, um, I believe we are done with Animal Crossing. We're not done with this stream, though. that off well because we're gonna be playing some Star Wars uh, uh, Nice Little Republic. I almost said Star Wars episode, episode 1 Racer which I definitely do need to play on stream eventually but that's not today. Uh, one second I'm just oh, looking for my Star Wars spreadsheet. There we go. So yeah, it's gonna play some nice old republic. So just give me uh, a couple minutes to just quickly swap over cables, start up the game. Where is the game? The game's up there. Okay, and um, yeah, so just give me a little bit to do that. <laughs> 